give everyone a preview. You'll be sitting right there. Yeah. If the Browns take Trubisky number one, what will be the first words out of your mouth? Wow. I mean, really, uh, you'll, you'll say wow from a pure from a from a value type of perspective. Meaning, look, even if they had zeroed in on Mitch, there's probably there's a better spot where you could probably pick him if that's really what you're into when you're really trying to maximize value in the draft here, and that's what everyone's trying to do here. It, that's the only reason why I'll say wow. I, I won't be surprised that they have zeroed in on him because look, quarterback evaluation is largely subjective anyway. And if they believe that that's their guy, then at the end of the day. If he winds up being the quarterback that they think he's going to be, it's not going to matter if you t- picked him 1, 6, 12, if you picked him 5. It doesn't matter. The fact of the matter, though, is that because of all the information that's coming out, it's obvious that they have zeroed in on him. They think he is the guy that three, four, five years from now is going to take them to where they want to go. So they, don't be- they believe, obviously, if they're even considering him taking him number one, that it doesn't really matter if they take him one or six. So. We'll all be surprised here on the outside, but on the inside, it obviously seems like they have some conviction about the kind of player that they're looking for, and he's the one.